Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Microsoft Flight Simulator and in today's episode we have been given the awesome privilege to check out FS Dream Team's soon to be released GSX. If you are interested in acquiring any of my Overkill's tutorial guides for Microsoft Flight Simulator, please consider joining me on Patreon. Patreon subscribers level tier 2 and above have access to all of my guides as well as any future updates and future guides that will be coming down the road. Link to Patreon can be found in the description below. Okay, so first off, couple disclaimers right out of the gate. GSX has not yet been released. This is a beta release that uh, the company FS Dream Team was kind enough to reach out to me and give me the opportunity to do a review or first impressions on. I really hate using the review. I got to stop using that term. First impressions on. Um, now, a, another disclaimer right out of the gate. Please, please, please don't skip this. Um, the they have recommended that we all review the manual first i am unable to reach it i don't know why when i click there is a button that i should be clicking that will bring up a pdf tutorial manual and for me nothing happens i have tried uninstalling reinstalling so please keep in mind that there may be some user error here that we may see in the video so i'm going to keep this video more high level than down into the nitty gritty while still trying to cover some of the features that i know it can be which brings us to the next segment. What is GSX? For those of you who don't know, GSX is an incredibly awesome third-party ground services application that changes everything from the jetways back here in the back. You can see all the texturing. If you guys, this is the default Phoenix Sky Harbor Airport. Um, the push bars that are back here, the tow rig here, um, the uh, look at the AC units and the generator units underneath the uh, um, jetway here, the banners up on the jetway themselves, Phoenix Sky Harbor International Airport, all these uh, warning labels and all that. None of that is here in the default scenery. It changes much of the emergency ground crew, uh, the trucks, some of the guys that you'll see walk around, your marshalers, your caterers. We're going to see a whole bunch of that today. Today, we are using the PMDG 737 with the Southwest Airlines livery. Um, now, one of the things that you want to make sure if you're using Southwest Airlines or Southwest Airlines, if you're using something like PMDG, uh, you want to make sure you clear out their uh, ground services first. So the uh, stairways, any of their pushback equipment, their fuel truck, whatever it may be, you want to make sure you clear those out. Same thing with Phoenix or any other aircraft that uses that. So if it has its own uh, ground service equipment, you want to get those away. Okay, so without further delay, let's start talking about the GSX and start showing off some of the stuff that it does because I'm super excited. Again, please remember this is a beta release. This is not the final product. We may see some bugs or odd behavior as we go through this. All right, enough jabber on. Let's get to the fun part. Okay, so after we've completed the installation, you should have a GSX button up here. So we're going to launch that. And I have seen sometimes it takes me more than one click to get it to populate. Here we go. Okay. So first let's do, uh, let's see here. Let's operate the jetways, right? Let's get those going. All right. Now I have seen this where it sort of tricks the camera out a little bit. Southwest airlines. That's our livery. So you select your livery ground handling and look at it, everything's changing down here. You guys can hear those awesome sounds. That's all the jetway happening there. Boom. Let's see. I think we can even walk through the door. Oh, no, the door didn't open yet. And check out the check out the textures on this jetway. Full. Oops. Hello. Animated lights. The whole shebang. So we could really slow things down if we want. Let me slow the drone camera down. Oh, this is going to drive everybody nuts, including myself. So let's see here. Where's our drone speed? Drone speed. Gosh, darn it. let's kick that down to like three. Hopefully that'll work better. Yeah, it's a little bit better. It's not quite as slow as I want it to be. All right, so we walk through there. Boom. All right, so now let's see what happens. Let's get a few other things going on here. Let's go to GSX and let's do 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 do. Let's get the catering trucks out. And again, we're going to use Southwest Airlines. Catering obviously. vehicles are on their way. 
gives you some audible. Now, I do believe a lot of this can be tweaked. Keep in mind, if you guys take a look down here, there's some really awesome features that I'm not going to go into today's video because of the fact that I haven't been able to read the manual and get the full information on. And I want to wait for that. I want to make sure I get that right. But you can see customize airport positions, customize airplane, GSX settings, all tons of different. Now, I think we can look at the settings safely without without giving away too much. You have a follow me car. You have parking slowdown speed where like when you're coming up to the gate, if you start taxing too fast, they'll tell you to slow down. Um, I'll let you guys sort of just peruse the settings here to get an idea. Like I said, I'm not going to be talking about any of these yet because I don't have a chance. Uh, but we do have the audio. Um, uh, your audio settings individually that can be set for just GSX. Um, but uh, we'll come back around to all of that here. We can even adjust some of the timings and how long it takes things to take place. But again, later on. So we know that we have the catering trucks on their way here. So let's go ahead and now let's get to maybe our loading stage. Come on, there we go. Okay, so let's do a, uh, see if we got pushback, additional services. What's in the additional services menu? I'm kind of curious. Request a GPU, yeah, let's do that. I want to see what the GPU textures look like. There's our catering truck, I think. And there's our GPU, check it out, check that out. Look at that, he brings it all over. Oh my God, I get so silly with this kind of stuff. I know I do, but I love it. Oh, that is so dope. It's even got the Hobart. Oh my gosh, that's a manufacturer, guys. That is so cool. <laughs> and Homeboy is still driving a Southwest cart. Oh, there's our catering trucks rolling in. What happens here? Does he actually plug it in? Why isn't external power available? Okay, that could be something with the 737 why the uh, the external power is not available. But let's go check that out. Hang on. Let's make sure it's not something in here. We'll come back to this. This is too cool. Uh, okay, so the ground power type. I don't want to request it and then double request it. So I don't want to... Oh, got the doors opening. The doors are opening. Let's go back outside. Dude, look at that! Look at that! Here he goes! I love the stuff like this, you guys. I freaking love it. I absolutely love this kind of stuff. What are you doing back there, Jerry? <laughs> that is totally awesome. Oh my gosh. I really want to know why ground power isn't available. I think I'm worried that I've done something. Oops, let me get back in the seat here. Uh, let's see here, can I turn it on? I wonder what happens if I just flip the switch. I don't want to hit the thing from down here. Whoa. Is it bringing its own or did it connect ours? No, it brought its own. What are you doing with the jetway? What are you doing? Dude, sometimes this thing gets so silly, it drives me crazy. Okay, I have no idea why the jetway was pushed away. That is so dumb. That kind of stuff drives me crazy. Get over here. There we go. You come back over here. I didn't even notice the guards around the... Look at that, dude. That is such awesome texturing. Oh my gosh. And these are actually the ground uh, supply units for, I believe, it's water and... I don't think that's part of the... Um, lavatory systems. At least I don't think it is. One of them, I think, is just water. Okay, well, we're going to get rid of that ground power because that's just wrong. I'm not going to ruin that image. We'll figure that out later. 
Okay, now I want to check out the cargo loading. Do, do, well, actually, you know what? Let's do this. Let's get our GSX going. Hang on. Let's request refueling. I love this. This is so cool. What's weeping at me? Oh, close rear entry door aft. Oh, I have to close the doors. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, yeah, gotcha. My bad. My gotcha. Okay. Closing doors. What is dope? Ah! Ah, so you're actually going to have to be watching for that as a pilot. You're going to have to make sure you're closing your doors. They're not going to close automatically. That is too cool. I love it. Ah, I love this kind of stuff, dudes. <laughs> I freaking love it. It's too cool. Okay, did we already press the fuel truck? Did it say the fuel truck was on its way? I think it did. Let's uh, let's start the boarding. Let load the. We have to do cargo separately. I wonder. Let's see here. I don't think so. Let's just do. Uh, let's see here. So we did catering. Oh, it says the aircraft's boarded. Why would we want to deboard? Oh, never mind. I see. Let's do that. Boarding requested. Hey, don't drive through my wing, pal. And I believe those are things that can be customized. How they enter and exit the parking location, uh, where they come in from, how far away they come in from. That was something that we used the GSX for in the uh, like P3D applications. Oh, here we go with cargo loaders. Here we go, cargo loaders. And I think I need to open the door for this guy over here. Check it out. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, let's see here. Do, 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 do. No, that's going to be equipment hatch. Cargo doors forward and aft. They're open. So it already went through that part for us. Let's go to doors. Uh, let's see here. Entry door aft left open door. Pilots boarding starting. Pilots boarding. Ooh, ooh. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see if we can see it. Look at that, here we come guys, that's us. Those are the pilots. That's me dragging my ass back there, walking like a tortoise. <laughs> that is so cool. Ah, what else we got going on? Let's check out the luggage. Let's go with the luggage. Oh, did we miss it? Oh, I didn't want to miss the luggage. I really hope we didn't miss the luggage. That would, that would like epically bum me out. Crew boarding starting. Okay, I'm coming back in here. We're going to watch some passengers board. Oop. <laughs> here come the flight attendants. Ah, oh, that is too awesome. I can't tell. I don't think they have, like, Southwest uniforms on or anything, but... Oh, well, maybe. <laughs> what was that? All the crew gets on the plane first. That door needs to go. That door is a little weird. <laughs> Welcome aboard, guys. This is the kind of stuff that makes the immersion just too cool. You can have so much fun with this, especially creating custom cameras and things like that. You know, Your crew has boarded. Cool. Passengers boarding starting. Oh, let's go look. Should we go look? Oh, that sounds like a baggage cart, though. Where's the luggage cart? Are they bringing us a luggage cart? No? Maybe? Oh. Whoa. Check it out, here they come. Yep, just strolling on down the jetway. Look at this guy, this guy's like ready for business. What's up, bro? What's up, man? I'm just gonna go to Vegas, make all kinds of money. That looks so awesome. Is there anybody inside it? No, okay. That is still cool. This 
This is so awesome, dudes. <laughs> that is so cool. Oh, man. Oh, man. I cannot get enough of this. This looks dope. Talk about real time, dude. 19 passengers out of 176. So ways to go on loading. I will catch you guys as that completes. Departure check completed. Bypass pin inserted. That is awesome. Check that out. Where are you going? Check him out, dude. Walking the plane. That is awesome. That's <laughs> too cool. This, this is what I've been waiting for. This, I hope you guys are enjoying this just as much as I am. GSX is so freaking cool. It adds so much to it. It adds so much more. Okay. Well, that was my fault as far as the parking brakes. I don't have my rudder pedals plugged in because we just got done moving. But I hope that you guys have enjoyed this little demo just as much as I have. I think this was an incredible product, and I cannot wait uh, to see it in its final release. Super, super excited for this, guys. Be on the lookout over the next few days, is my understanding. This product should be released and hit the mainstream. Um, super stuff. FS Dream Team, thank you so much for uh, giving me the opportunity to uh, check this one out. As always, guys, stay safe and healthy and be on the lookout the next one.